And now, 41 NBC's Business Spotlight. In the spotlight today, Bennett Financial. As we've been discussing, the Tax Cuts and Jobs Act has been very good to small businesses and the self-employed. And one of those areas that's been good is the depreciation deduction. Now, depreciation applies to things that have longer than a lifespan of one year in your business. So any type of equipment, vehicles, uh, buildings, or anything that you're using in your equipment to produce uh, money that would be considered an asset is gonna fall under the depreciation laws. And currently we have two depreciation laws. We have one that's known as a section 179. The section 179 expense is gonna be very liberal this year. You're gonna be allowed up to a million dollars in deductions on your first two and a half million dollars worth of assets uh, purchased. So that's an increase from 510,000 under the old law out to a million dollars. In addition, uh, the luxury vehicles deduction has been increased. You're gonna be able to write off more of your vehicles for your, for your businesses. And as you can see from the graphic here, Uh, in the first year, it starts off at $10,000 and then uh, decreases over the period of five years, but you're gonna still have some very good deductions. Additionally, the bonus depreciation now applies to used equipment as well. If you have a vehicle now in that first year, that, that luxury vehicle for your business, you're gonna be able to write off $18,000. So that's gonna be a big change. Uh, for business owners this year if you are purchasing new vehicles for your business. So again, uh, the Tax Cuts and Jobs Act have been very good for the self-employed. And if you have a self-employed business, uh, come see me today at Bennett Financial. We'll help you get it figured out.